This is a continuation of the post-lab discussion on carboxylic acid. Now we will talk about the reaction with sodium bicarbonate. Recalling the solubility in water, acetic acid was soluble, succinic acid was soluble. But benzoic acid, stearic acid, and oleic acid were not soluble in water. Let us recall the reaction of benzoic acid in 10% sodium bicarbonate solution. What I'd like to show here is the production of bubbles. Okay, tingnan natin. May, may bubbles yan. Hindi lang as prominent as the bubbles that we observe in, ayan o, ayan o, in succinic acid and acetic acid. Ayan, may bubbles. Okay. Okay, so this is to recall the reaction of sodium bicarbonate and succinic acid. The obvious yung production of bubbles. And I know that acetic acid will also react in the same manner. Obvious yung production of bubbles. These bubbles are carbon dioxide bubbles. This is from the benzoic acid. Okay, so those, th those three samples will produce bubbles with sodium bicarbonate. So this is the chemistry involved in the production of gas in sodium bicarbonate solution. So take note of the gas that was produced, carbon dioxide, in all three reactions. So with acetic acid and sodium bicarbonate, the salt that was produced was sodium acetate and of course water. This is a neutralization reaction or an acid-base reaction. This is the gas that caused the effervescence. This is succinic acid sodium bicarbonate the salt that was produced was sodium succinate and water and this is the gas carbon dioxide with benzoic acid and sodium bicarbonate 
the salt that was produced was sodium benzoate and you have the gas. So all of these three materials took part in an acid-base reaction to produce bubbling, which is carbon dioxide gas. And oleic and stearic acid remain non-reactive with sodium bicarbonate. 